give yourself unto the Lord and he will lift you up. Or in this case, get sucked into a ventilation shaft. Good job, Dice. Now, I'm going to be honest with y'all, I tried to put together just a simple, guys, here are the bugs that I found when it comes to Battlefield 4. And I wanted to be mad about it. I wanted to rage about it. I wanted to break something. But you know what, guys? By the end of all of this, it was just so damn funny that I thought there was nothing more appropriate than just putting together some sort of a little troll video. Because let's face it, that's what DICE did to us. I loved Battlefield 3, I loved all the previous Battlefields, and Battlefield 4 now is just like, well, we've got all your money, ha ha ha, we don't have to make you a game that actually works. I mean, come on, look at SimCity, EA, Obama. So after I had the helicopter land on my head, I thought it would be fun to jump in the little boat and maybe blow up some noobs and stuff, but no, I had to hear this horrible pop 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 sound. What the fuck is this? Okay, I get it, I get it, it's a sound glitch, okay, bugs happen, but how do you explain this one here? I'm just riding along in the boat, getting ready to take on this boat, waiting for us to turn over there without touching a damn thing on the keyboard. Oh, look at that! I spawned a sea dew out of my butthole! Explain that one to me, which I didn't touch anything, <laughs> now we're on a sea dew! Uh, okay... In this next clip, I really hope that you're not partial to epileptic seizures because Battlefield 4 is quite likely to put you in the emergency room. Here we are just driving along in a tank, doing our thing, getting hit by a rocket, and check out the light show. Oh yeah. Now in this next clip, we're gonna take a look at something that's actually been around since a lot earlier versions of Battlefield 3. Which really begs the question, why is it still a bug if they've known about it for the last four generations of the game? As you can see right there, we just collided. He's going down in a ball of flames and I am at 100% health. I have the toughest little bird in all of history. Until I got ran into by a jet and then got given epileptic seizure again. Now, I love tanks. Like... I really, really love tanks. But you know what's really important when you're driving a tank? Is when you can actually hear the tank. Yeah. Apparently we have a hybrid tank. Electric powered. We are environmentally friendly people. We're going green. Check it out. Once again. Yep. No engine in this bad boy. Now problem number two is in Battlefield 3 they had ridiculously huge tracer rounds. So in Battlefield 4 they fixed that problem by making invisible bullets. Check it out. How in the hell are you supposed to see what you're hitting when the uh, tracer rounds are non-existent? Check it out. Where's the bullets? Perhaps I'm shooting blanks. But then again I wouldn't have a kid if that were true either, would it? Well. I guess you just have to guess where the bullet drop is actually landing. There used to be little tracer rounds, but at some point during this match they completely disappeared. Now this next clip you guys already saw in the beginning of this video, but it warrants taking a second look. Apparently in the world of Battlefield 4, gravity does not seem to exist as we know it today. Or maybe there was a giant tentacle creature pulling him up there. I particularly liked how the guy who killed him took two looks at that and said, Fuck this, I'm out of here. This is just a small sample of things I was able to capture in only about a 10 to 15 minute period of time that I had my recorder actually running. And I was able to catch all this funky shit here with Battlefield 4. If we've learned anything here tonight, guys, please let it be. Stop ordering games from EA. Stop pre-ordering because you're not giving them any reason to bring you a good product because they already have your money before you realize that this is a piece of shit. 
Of course, things are going to get better over time as patches come out, but if they already have your money, there's no reason for them to wait until they have a nice, solid product. You heard it here on Jay's Two Cents. Battlefield 4 is absolute garbage right now. It'll get better, but until then, DICE, you can pretty much eat shit. Have a nice night. Hope you subscribe. See you later.